Previously on Cars Adventures, while searching a junkyard in Puerto Rico for a paintbrush that used to belong to one of Ramon's favorite painters so that she could give it to him for Christmas. Give the paintbrush to Ramon, that is, not the painter. The painter's dead. Uh, anyway, Flo accidentally encountered the Lemons, who it turns out were broken out of jail by none other than Aiden. Now, let's take a trip back. Back to before Flo encountered them to see just how they got into their current situation. Well, that could have gone better if only some trainings I know of would have ensured Herb Karbler's death. Then, those cars wouldn't have known how to take all of us down. But in doing so, you have all proven something to me. You're far weaker than I could have possibly imagined. You're all just a group of fools. You're all idiots. Here I was, spending all this time training you. Well, I guess we'll just have to work even harder. As will all of you. Or else. What? What's the next plan, boss? Yeah, what happens next? Next? As I said, we make all of you undergo even more rigorous training. But there's another thing we must do. We need to expand. Security breach! This is a security breach! <laughs> ah! So, boss, uh, did it work? Did you get the guys you wanted to get? How about you ask them yourself? What? I thought you were supposed to be getting all the lemons. You just got these three wimps. For your information, these are three of the most powerful lemons out there. Tubbs Pacer, head of the Pacer family. Victor Hugo, head of the Hugo family. And Vladimir Trunkov, head of of the Trunkov family. I got all the lemons. I broke every single one of those losers out of jail. But these three, these are the ones that really matter. These are the ones that I will be giving orders to. You see, the lemons are expendable. That's why I wanted them. What Lightning McQueen and his racer friends have is strength in numbers. Yes, we're powerful, but he has connections. That's what I want. More connections. Which is why I've broken every last lemon I could find out of jail. All of the ones that Lightning McQueen and his protectors of Radiator Springs locked up a few years back. These lemons will act as an army that will strike fear into those that we fight. They may not be as well trained as all of you, but they will still undergo a lot of training to make themselves stronger. But at the end of the day, the point of them is to be expendable. You guys are my elite troops. They are the standard troops, if that makes any sense. Do you three understand? Eh, I don't know. You say... You want the lemons to be expendable? Yes. Yes, I do. And you say this right in front of three of the lemons? Hmm? I don't know. It doesn't really seem like the best idea. Oh. Oh, don't worry. I'll make sure you three are on board. I will make sure of it. Man, Graham. Free of jail. Finally out. <laughs> Kudos to that Aiden guy, huh? Nice of him to take us out of jail. Yeah, certainly. Everyone's loving it. 
Look at Tyler and Fred over there having the time of their lives. Yeah, just driving around in cycles. Man, they're having so much fun. And Stefan Gremski and all the other lemons we don't own but are going to claim are here. Yeah, yeah, that's what we'll do. Mm-hmm. Hey, you two! Yeah? Dubs Baser! How's it going? By the way, have you seen Jay Kirby? Jay Kirby Gremlin. No, I... I'm not sure where he is. Why? I don't know. I mean, all of us are out of jail, but I haven't seen him anywhere. Yeah, strange, certainly. But look, I don't know how I feel about that Aiden guy. Kind of seems like bad news to me. He breaks us out of jail and holds a meeting with me, Vlad, and Victor. And the first thing he says is that he wants us to be an expendable army for him. Expendable? We ain't expendable. We're kind of expendable. Yeah, yeah, kind of expendable. But not fully expendable. What, he wants us to be the guys that go out there and do his dirty work? Yeah. He said he wants us to be able to strike fear into others by giving him strength in numbers, but we'll just be expendable to him, and his other little trainees will be, you know, doing the big stuff. Huh. You believe this guy? He wants us to be expendable? What a joke. The lemons are at the top of the crime world, pal. You can't take us down. No. No, you can't. I can't believe this guy. Can you believe this guy? <sighs> expendable. That's what he thinks of us. After everything we've done. After all of the crimes that we have committed. We are just seen as these simple, expendable fools. <laughs> hey, Vlad, ever gonna take that parking boot off? I don't know, it's kind of comfortable. Okay then, expendable. Yeah, I'll show that Aiden guy expendable. He broke us out of jail and now immediately thinks that we're gonna be buddy-buddy with him, that we're gonna work with him. Who does he think he is? You can't control the lemons. Only the lemons control the lemons. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you for agreeing with us, Fred Fisbowski, who is totally over there. Yeah. Let's knock that guy down a peg. Who, Fred? No, no, Aiden, Aiden. Right, 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 Aiden. 